Hello and good morning to everyone over at Bodhi Salon. I want to take the time out to thank you, Bodhi, for chatting with me the other day. My name is Viola Barnett and with Generational Leads. And I want to go over a few things that you can do today to help generate more business uh, through Google and also put more revenue in your pocket. And the three things I want to talk about are content on your website, backlinks and citations, and keywords. And I'll go into detail about exactly what all of those things mean. So let's go ahead and not waste any more of your time or mine and jump right into it. So first of all, I want to say I love your website. It's so fresh. I love the photos. They look amazing. Um, it's pretty clear what you guys kind of specialize in, and it looks really good. However, the concern is when, when it comes to Google, Google optimizes uh, the home pages upwards of 1500 words. And that's how you could get more keywords in there because the keywords is pretty much what gets people to click on your page to find Bodhi Salon. So what do I mean by that? I'm going to go over here. This is a little uh, site that I use called ARES that I pay about $400 a month for. And what we can see here is that on Google, you guys are getting 120 clicks per month, which is pretty low because we could definitely get more than that. Once we get the clicks up, then you'll be able to get your money up. Now, right here, if you see these two circles right here, this is these are your uh, URL ratings, and this is how Google rates you. And these is, this is your domain rating. This is on a scale of 100. Once you start seeing this green get upwards, to close to getting these circles filled up, you'll notice that these numbers are going to be changing as well. So now when we go to keywords, keywords are very, very important. Keywords are basically words that people are typing in on Google in order to find where you guys are located or in order to find your page. And what we're noticing is you're only getting 120 clicks per month. Now, if you take a look at your competition, uh, which I found on Google, Fox and Jane Salon. Now, the first thing I want to say about their page, as you, as you can see, their homepage, they have absolutely no information on it. Yet, they're still beating you by a landslide when it comes to just typing in hair salons in Brooklyn, New York. They are popping up on the first page before you right here at number six. So I just selected them because they're also popping up up here and I'll explain this in a minute. But I wanna go back to where I was with their homepage and let's go into RFs for their page. So now we're looking at Fox and Jane Salon Brooklyn and look at their organic traffic. They're getting 5,000 upwards of 6,000 clicks per month. And if you look at their keywords right here, they have over a thousand keywords close to 2000 remember what I said Google optimizes and pays attention to anything over 1500 keywords and that's by getting that content on the home page up these are the referring domain 635 um, we're gonna get into more detail about the backlinks but take a look at these circles you see how the circles are moving upwards this is what's gonna make the difference here when it comes to getting more customers more organic traffic that's looking for hair salons in Brooklyn New York and they're clicking on you before they click on anyone else so let's go back to Google now the first thing we look at is you see the map pack here now that's what we call it we call it the map pack these are citations citations are basically anywhere throughout the internet where you are listed um, in a directory for your name your address and your phone number now as you and i both know when we go on google to look for something we don't go anywhere past this home page we, we very rarely click view all we start getting skeptical with anything past one two or three so i'm sure you're asking yourself how do i get into this map pack how do i get ranked into these top three it's very simple it's citations we have to get you across a, a lot more um a lot more different directories even yahoo um, even yahoo facebook all of these different places have citation areas where you can be listed and your your website can be listed so that way you can get in the top three now the last thing i want to go over with you that can help bring more revenue to your business are backlinks. Backlinks are so important. Backlinks is basically, in an overview, backlinks are site A pointing to site B to give site B more revenue, give site B more um, juice, so to speak. So let's say, for example, your site B, okay, um, Bodhi Salon is site B, and site A is a blogger. 
And on that blogger, they're talking about the best hair salons in Brooklyn, New York. And it's pointing, there's a link in there that's pointing to you. That's one backlink. So if the person clicks on that link from their blog, it now leads to you. Now, of course, not all black backlinks are equal. Google does recognize which ones are relevant and which ones are irrelevant. For example, if it just so happens your site is on a Pizza Hut website, obviously that's not going to count with the 116 because that has nothing to do with hair. And Google recognized that because again, Google acknowledges keywords, organic keywords. So let's go over what we went over today. We went over three things. We went over content. You want to get your website, your home website, upwards 1500 to 2000 words um like i said if you take a look at your competition website obviously you could beat them out by a landslide because their website has absolutely no words on the home page um so you could beat them in that area the second thing we went over were backlinks and citations you remember citations is what gets you up here in the map pack and the backlinks is what's going to lead back towards your site Okay, and lastly, keywords, keywords, keywords. See, they have 1,000, almost 2,000 keywords. Somehow it's hidden in that page. How is that possible? You see, again, that's the thing. It's not always about how pretty the website is. You got to remember, people come to these pages, and it's not you, whoever created the site. Um, they have to remember, web designers forget that people don't come to the page just to see how pretty it is. They come there for information, and that's where the information is. The information is hidden in the keywords. It's always on that landing page. It has to be on this page because you want people to click to get further. If they don't see what they need here, nine times out of 10, we don't go any further. So again, my name is Viola Barnett with Generational Leads. If you find any of this information helpful, um, go ahead and use it. See how you can apply it to yourself. Um, and if you need help assisting with it and you think that I can assist you with your website and with any of this information, give me a call at 718 702 to 843. Again, it was a pleasure and thanks for taking the time out to, to listen to this video. Talk to you soon.